Well, the video is alarming and heartbreaking at the same time. A father pulled over for what police say is his 11th DWI arrest found his young son standing on the front seat looking out the passenger window. News 13's Jeannie Nguyen is here with the video. Dean and Jessica, along with an unsecured child, police also found a bottle of vodka in the dad's car. When police pulled him over, he gave an unusual excuse for his erratic driving. How much you had to drink today, Terry? Maybe half pint. Half pint? According to a criminal complaint, 911 calls were coming in about a driver speeding around on the shoulders of a highway near Pecos. This is what state police saw when they stopped the Nissan, a four-year-old boy standing in the front passenger seat, peering out the window. Is this your grandson or who's this? No, that's my sure. son. After admitting to drinking alcohol, the driver, Terry Huff, continued to slur his words and told officers there was a perfect explanation for driving on the side of the highway. I just mowed down weed with my, my truck. But police had heard enough. The alcohol found in your vehicle, the alcohol observed on your breath, okay? The way your eyes are bloodshot and watery, your slurred speech, all right? I'm going to place you under arrest right now for DUI. A DUI? Yes, now, sir. I'll never get my wife to the That's not on me. During the entire process, the 56-year-old was worried CYFD was going to come and take his son away. But instead, an officer called Huff's wife, who was in Denver at the time being treated for cancer. Well, I'm unfortunately, unfortunately to tell you that your husband has now been arrested for DWI. That's when Huff's wife told officers to put their son into the care of a pastor. That pastor happened to live right across the street from the DWI stop. Now Huff had a blood alcohol level of 0.24, three times the legal limit. It's unclear how many of his other 10 DWI arrests have led to convictions. Dean, back to you. All right, thank you, Jeannie. Terry Huff is also charged with child abuse. His bond was set at $15,000 cash only, but a judge let him out for free while he awaits trial.